Hi everybody, welcome to YS Kong Driving. It's a beautiful Monday morning with clear skies and we are in Pacific Towers, the new office of Honda Malaysia. And what do we have here? This, guys, is the game changer. The new Honda City, not yet launched. This is the development model. But let me tell you something. This country, Malaysia, is going to be the premier, or rather Malaysia is going to host the premier because this is the first time the new city will be seen with the hybrid system, which is the IMMD. It promises a lot of stuff. We have tested the car uh, in Japan, or rather the system in Japan last year. So you can see our video on IMMD. But guys, this car will have it. And you know what's the key point about this? It's 253 Newton meters of torque. That's a lot of torque for a B segment sedan okay and the engine is also improved with dual overhead cam okay so that's just some of the surprises let's go deeper into it not very much deeper because they have not revealed we cannot see the inside of the car we can only see the outside now as I said this is a development car and the RS is the top of the range because this is the one that holds the IMMD Intelligent multi-mode drive uh, hybrid system which is which actually uses more of the electric motor for driving because the electric motor has higher torque than the engine so therefore one of the main things the engine has to do is actually just to charge the system up so that the electric motor can be used so it will start off on electric motor all the time and the job of the engine is to charge it up when it's going through laboring like let's say we are climbing up Gunting, it will be engine and motor working together and when it's on high speed only the engine is running so there are actually three modes of working and uh, more of that later okay the rs uh, this body is totally totally new okay it may look a little bit like the old uh, city but actually it looks totally different the grille and front are totally different now this one is not full spec yet because there's still development the launch will be in the last quarter of the year all right let's move to the other side in terms of the side view this car is actually longer than the previous one according to a little bird the length is longer so therefore the wheelbase is longer um, it's the same roughly the same width as previously and it's slightly shorter so you get a longer and a sleeker body so the wheelbase i would venture a guess the old one was 2600 mm i would say this would be either 2625 or 2650 because if you go to 2700 you're already hitting the honda civic class so this is one class below it will be slightly shorter than 2700 wheels are 16 inch and uh, well this look like very honda rims rims i'm actually quite neutral to rims as long as they're easy to clean this one look all right because they're black inside so they're easy to clean ventilated this in the front and quite a big caliper mcpherson struts for suspension 16 inch okay now going along the side you have another first in the segment this is called the Honda Lane Watch. Those of you who are familiar with Honda Lane Watch will know that when you signal left, you will see on your screen a camera sh shooting at the back to tell you whether there's a car or motorbike approaching. So it's a very good feature. But don't forget to use your signal, yeah? No signal means no picture. Okay, let's move to the back. Doors are big and wide. And so, wow, the back door is long which means it's going to get be very easy to get in and out of the car of course you have color match door handles and here's another thing this button looks like the easy entry mode is also applicable on this side not sure about the current model but this one has it on this side too at the rear you get solid disc same size tires and uh, what looks like a torsion beam suspension okay let's move further back at the back you get this is a new light cluster looks very nice 
LED and also uh, reverse lights and LED DRLs. So I see a reverse camera, a little rear lip. This is not a rear lip, this is a diffuser. Hmm. Looks nice. Not sure whether it has any use, but it does make the car look good. And here, this is the official name for the IMD. It's EHEV. So this is half an electric vehicle. This is the all-new Honda City presented by YS Kong. Uh, the launch will be towards the end of the year and uh, we promise to give you more specs as and when we get them. All right then, thanks very much for watching. Good luck and bye-bye.